This is a ZNS News update. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Keisha Adderley. Vendors at the Potosky Dock say business has dried up in the days following a double murder there this week. They spoke with ZNS News today, calling for more police presence and ramped up security measures like closed circuit television. A memorial service at the Defense Force Base in Coral Harbor marked the 39th anniversary of the HMBS Flamingo incident. Four Marines lost their lives during the sinking of the ship back in May of 1980. Governor General, Her Excellency, the Most Honorable Dame Marguerite Pindling, says the incident was a defining moment in the nation's history and that the country owes members of the armed forces a debt of gratitude. And the Minnesota administration celebrating two years in governance. On May 10, 2017, the Free National Movement defeated the Progressive Liberal Party to usher in its place in leadership. Party Chairman Carl Kulmer says the administration has turned the country around, increasing investor confidence and drawing in a number of developments now on the drawing board. This has been your ZNS News Update. I'm Keisha Adderley. Good afternoon.